welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. Anyways, we are going, you can't, you can't, you can't. Okay. What we're going to do is we're going to do old wives tales, gender predictions before we find out the gender of our baby, which is next week. But I thought this would be so much fun to see which ones are actually right and which ones are not even close. So, without further ado, number one we, is the ring test. So we need to do that later. So we'll do number two, Why? three. Because these two are like going and doing stuff. You said we had 17 to do. We do. Number three, hair growth. If your hair is growing nice and thick and hair growth in other places, it's a boy. And if your hair hasn't changed, it's a girl. Remember my, I grew hair on my mm -hmm. belly. So I have hair growth on, on my belly. It's weird, but it's a boy for that one. Yeah. One for boy, yep for girl. Belly line. Yeah, so if the line, I can't remember what it's called, but has grown all along the belly, it's a boy. And if it's grown south of the belly, it's a girl. What line? It's like a dark line. Do I even mm. have one? Yeah, right here. Is it up here or no? Yeah, it is. So the whole belly? Mm -hmm. Okay. Whole belly is a boy. Ding! Two, two for the boy. Okay. Balance. Uh, has my balance changed? Am I clumsy or more off balance? Well, I don't know, because you were pretty clumsy before. <laughs> I was not. Mm -hmm. No, you can't see, because then you'll say what you want it to be. I No change. No change? That's a girl. One for girl, two for boy. Okay, has my mood been chill or moody? Moody. It's a girl. Tied! Okay, morning sickness. No morning sickness or morning sickness? None. I had absolutely no morning sickness and I'm not complaining. What is it? It's a boy. So we're at three, three for two. boy, two for girl. Yeah. Um, do I have a pregnancy glow or no glow, not looking good? I don't know. I would say glow. I don't know either, You're but happy. I don't know. we'll go glow? with boy because that means I have a glow. Am I carrying high or low? I have no idea. It's our first time. I don't know either, but does it look like my belly's high? Does it look? I'm going to say low because if I pull down, then it's like more of a belly. Sure. Let's go with low. I have no idea. I don't either. We're going to go with low. Low is a boy. Ooh. Okay. I hope this is right. <laughs> weight gain. Uh, am I just all belly, can't tell I've gained any weight, or is my belly a little bit smaller and you can tell I've gained weight? Um, all belly. Can't tell I've gained weight at all? Not in your face. No, like, but in Nowhere, my... no. Okay. Just the belly's coming out. Boy. Look at that. Boy's just popping I out here. Right. Food craving. Salty or sweet? Here's the, here's the thing. Both. I like salt and sweet, always, even before I was pregnant. And that hasn't really changed. Some days I'm like crazy into like chocolate and sweet stuff. And other days I just want like chips crackers. and crackers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Actually not so much with the sweet or with the salty lately. It's been more sweet lately, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, sweet is a girl. Cause girls are sweet. Daddy, what's this? <laughs> <laughs> okay, daddy. Is the dad gaining weight or not? Have you gained any weight? I have no idea. I'd have to look. Go weigh yourself. Oh, I don't know. Let's take the cat. I'm not Okay. We'll just sit here while Bryce weighs himself to see if he's gained weight or not gained any weight since we got pregnant. Have like that Jeopardy thing. Do, do. Yes. yes, you've gained weight. Yes. It's a girl. Okay, baby's heart rate. Heart rate faster than 140 or lower. Do you remember what it was in that video that we watched? I thought it was higher than 140. It was. It was 168. Yeah. Okay. How do you know? Why didn't you just say? Cause that one. See if you remember. Faster than 140 is a girl. 
them. Okay, Chinese calendar. So because we record everything on my phone, I couldn't pull it up on my phone to show you guys. But what are you? Just grab my phone. Oh. Or you have it on. I have it on. I already, I already did it. So what you do with this Chinese calendar is you take how old the mother is and the month you conceived the baby and just follow the lines and go together. So I'm 26. We conceived in January, and if you follow the calendar. It's a boy, is what the calendar is saying. Headaches, have I had lots of headaches or no? Yes. Yeah, at the beginning it was like crazy headaches. Mm -hmm. So yes, so boy. Okay, cold feet, yes or no? No, not like usual. No, so girl. Okay, and then our guesses. Girl. What? <laughs> because I want a boy, so it's probably gonna be a girl. <laughs> okay, I honestly don't know. It like changes every week. Actually, it can change every second day where I'm like, oh, it's a boy. And sometimes when I'm like <laughs> talking about our baby, I'm thinking it's a girl. Mm -hmm. So I don't really know. You don't care. I don't either. care either. As long as it's healthy, I really don't care. I don't care either. I just think a little dude would be cool. Precious little princess would be too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now we have a few more. So we have the ring test. So you take a strand of string and tie it to your ring and hold it over your belly. If the ring sways in a circle, it's a girl. If it sways side to side, it's a boy. It's crazy because, like, if I stand here, I have a belly, but watch when I lay down, <laughs> it's like gone. Okay. I don't know if I have to lay flat. Like, it didn't say. So like, well, yeah, because you have to lay flat to this perfect properly. <laughs> but if I lay flat, I don't have a belly at all. Yeah, you do. Not really. Yeah, you do. I guess compared to what I, I have. I honestly don't know if this is going to work. I don't know. You gotta hold it. Sorry. Yeah, I don't know. This is going to. Maybe close it a bit though. Side. Definitely hasn't made a circle. No, I say side to side for you. Okay, we'll go with side to side. Okay, side to side is what the ring swayed, and side to side is a boy. So the pupil test is you go to a mirror and you look at it for one minute. If your pupil dilates, it's a boy. If your pupil stays the same, it's a girl. So here we go. I don't know if they're dilated or not. Well, just you have to watch and see if your pupil changes. Mm-hmm. Every time I blink, they change. This one's hard to do. Yeah. They look the same to me, no? Except they got bigger or smaller. They get bigger and then I blink and they go small. Okay, well, so, I'm invalid. Okay. Invalid. Okay, so that one's invalid, the pupil test, because they change. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine for boy. And there's 17? Yeah, and then we have. So there's only, oh no. Yeah, one, two, eight. three, four, five, six, no. There's 16. You missed the page. You missed this page. No, I didn't. Oh, yeah, there's 16. Yeah. So, seven, there should only be, yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Did you guess? Whoa, nine for boy and six, seven for girl. Mm -hmm. It's going to be backwards to what it says. Probably. I've watched a million of these videos on they don't work. YouTube and. It's lots of fun. Because according to this, we're having a boy. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to swing the bat and it's going to be a pink. A pink. Thing when it crashes to the ground. You never, never know what we're going to have. They're lots of fun and it's cool to try it out and see what we're going to have. Mm -hmm. um, it would be kind of cool to see like how close it works out to be. 
But in the long run, I don't know if I fully like believe in them either. Like they're cool to try, but. It's weird, the odds are 50-50. Yeah, really. <laughs> funny guy. So yeah, that's it. According to the Wives Tales gender prediction, we are going to have a boy. We will be finding out in less than a week what we are having. Yeah. So, and that's gonna be a whole new video, but I'm really excited to find out. I think I'm starting to get like a little nervous. Why nervous? Too. I don't know. I just, I'm, I'm, I'm excited. I'm very excited. So yeah, less than a week, we're gonna find out what we're having. Could be bow ties and ribbons and pretty pink dresses. Or cute little suits and dinosaurs and... Girls can like dinosaurs. I don't know, I just picture boys like <laughs> dinosaurs more. <laughs> Maybe that's just me thing. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed our little wives' tales prediction as to what we're going to have. And um, yeah, don't forget to like this channel on your way out because it gives my channel extra support, as well as hit the subscribe button. I upload new videos once every week.